Need to service a Haas machine? Veteran service engineer Brian Dickinson tracks down issues that come up at customer shops so you can tackle them head on. Hi, I'm Brian, and welcome to today's Haas service tip. Today I'd like to talk to you about the auto air gun. Sometimes a customer will complain that the auto air gun has stopped working. The auto air gun is a fairly straightforward piece of engineering with just one little thing to watch out for. Let's go take a look. The first thing to check when the auto air gun isn't working is the air tube itself. If it gets kinked or broken, it's not going to provide air at the spindle. The auto air gun uses a solenoid to deliver air. Use the name 83 command to turn the air gun on and then check the solenoid wires with an inductive voltage sensor to make sure they have voltage. If there's no voltage, the issue isn't with the auto air gun, but with the cable between the I.O. board and the solenoid. If the wires have voltage, the problem is most likely the solenoid. So take a look inside the solenoid for signs of contamination. Here's the little thing to watch out for. If the solenoid's contaminated, it's because there's moisture in the shop's air system. Use a water trap on the airlines and make sure they don't have any leaks or any excessive bends or joints where moisture can get trapped. For more information, visit DIY.HaasCNC.com. That's it for today's Haas service tip. Thanks for watching.